All right, back at it again on the Warrior. Uh, got this back part polished up. Let me look how nice that looks. You can see me. Um, it used to look like this down here. So, I mean, quite the difference. But, chain case is, well, the cover's back on. It's not together yet. Because it shouldn't be. Anyways, we're doing plugs today. Uh, the plugs, I believe you should be right, are CR9E. NGKs. Eh, yeah. should work. My dad's got titanium some sort of somethings in his fancy pants ones, but his are a pain to get to. Mine, you flip the hood, and then these just twist a little bit. Oh, they're, I can't do it one-handed, but they're, they're a bitch. I, I, I know they are because I did it on my dad's sled. His have a little bolt in the front, and then, yeah, so... So, all right, here, here we go. All right, let me get this put on here. Hopefully all the angles are good again today. They should be. They seemed pretty all right on my last video, but my only true complaint about this whole entire headset is digs into your head a little bit after a while wearing it. But looking down, I'm not too worried. So I'm just gonna start on this other side. Something I found is it's better to have the camera on the left side of your body, so um, let's see. Now, actually, it's right. I do. I unplugged my dad's because I was worried that I was gonna break them. Because it, uh, it's just nicer, in my opinion, to find where you can pull best and give it a yank. Now well, let's have a look down the cylinder. Hole or spark plug hole. Sorry for hitting the camera. Uh, I don't know if you guys can see that or not down there. But there isn't a whole ton of powder rust, so I feel okay about taking that out. And if I remember right, uh, if I remember right, I need to move the snow floor. No, if I remember right, which I think I do, it should be in this front toolkit here. I could be wrong, but. See, nice toolkit. You got a wrench. I guess a spare key. But if I remember right, it's probably this. No, not it right. Oh, that's probably the extension to this. Does this whole tray pull out? Pull out? Yeah, it does. I recommend popping this out first. Makes it a lot easier. Ah, yeah, okay. I smell what you're cooking. Well, let's make sure, before I begin, that these are indeed the same. Or, I'm sure they're the same, but see if they're the same for that. Where's my multi-tool? I have a multi-tool. Make sure I'm not using it. It'll make a difference if I use it here. Alright. Let's see. Does that get her open? Oh yeah. Oh nice. It's a I love multi-tools or leathermans, whatever you want to call them. Ah. Yep, it's the same plug. So they got this really small little thread. I'm sure it's the same. Hey. You know what I just realized? That's missing something. Is this one missing it too? Huh. Well, uh, my advice to you, make sure you have your old plugs, because fucking A, every one of these, they're all missing the screw-on caps. So, 
Make sure you got those, I guess. <laughs> I don't, really don't know what else to say. Uh, excuse me. Okay, anyway. <sighs> How the fuck are you supposed to get this off? So you got this, okay. Then do you use, you must just use this tool. I'm learning guys. Last time I did this on my dad's sled, I used a, I didn't use this at all. Ah, I see how it works now. Uh, in that toolkit, if you have a, well, if you're watching this, there's a very good chance you actually have this or you're just watching it because you're bored or whatever. Uh, I would make sure you have a Phillips screwdriver because to get to that, you need to have a Phillips screwdriver to take off the side panels. And uh, trust me, you want to take off the side panels to get to it. Wow, that is not threading out nicely. That's all I'm going to say. I mean, it's coming, but she ain't happy. This is better than doing it with a 5A socket, I'll tell you that. Oh, oh. Ooh, oh, yeah, that's that's good and carboned up. Look at that. Yeah, it was, it was probably time, considering how I'm going to just take a wild guess. Do these just not need those, or? I mean, there's got to be a reason that they don't have that. Mm. I didn't have it when I pulled it out. I mean, I'll check the other ones, but... Good song right now. Five finger nut punch. Love that band. All right, let's see. I'm waiting on parts for the skid. There's uh, the bushings on the bottom down there. You can see the two sitting there. Those two, uh, well, I'm not really gonna say a whole lot besides the bushing is completely gone. Well, should have left my light over there. I'd like to just take another look down that, that hole there. Just see how good it's actually looking. You guys probably can't see it, and I'm sorry for that. But, what choice do I have? I'll just be careful. Throw it in without that other stuff, and uh, you'll be good. So yeah, I recommend, I know some people don't take the wires off, take the wires off. You'll thank yourself. Well, I'm telling you, you'll thank yourself, how about that? I'm telling you to thank yourself because I've uh, done this before, so just trust me. Don't over tighten it, but tighten it good. That's good, right there. And out she comes. Yeah, I mean, there isn't a, okay, I guess there isn't things on there. These plugs might've been done before, but uh, whatever. In negative conditions, it definitely has a, it's a pig to get it started. So I'm hoping this will maybe change something as far as that goes, but. Or not, I don't 
genau. Okay. So, next. And then you just repeat that for all of them. So, I mean, it's, it's pretty, pretty easy. I mean, it's really not hard at all. No, that one's missing the thing too. This one, this these uh, sparkle holes actually aren't as bad as I've seen them. I know some people have a ton of powder rust, not thick. But... Well, that's gonna do it for this video. I mean, there's not really a whole lot else to film as far as that goes. I'll film when I polish more of the tunnel and do more of the skid. Um, skid. My only advice if you're gonna do a skid like this, just take a jack or a ratchet strap. Hold the track up once you take it off, and then lift the back end up or something like that, especially if you're doing the chain case too. Who got? I mean, that, uh, that's about it, guys. It's already an 11 minute video, so this is like a 40 minute job. So, thanks for watching.